Oh my gosh, man. I'm so dirty. Hello, everyone. Welcome to Byron Now, the ultimate Fire Immunity fan channel. Woo! Damn, I lost the password to the channel, man. That's why I've been gone for so long. I treated you guys like a black father, man. I just disappeared, went to get some milk. Ten years later, we're back. Wow, Bayern Munich are going to be signing, well, have signed uh, Sacha Bowie, man. You guys know that boy, that 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 baller. Honestly, I, I'm going to be real. I don't know who this guy is. Uh, I have not. Uh, look, 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 guys, I've just been so busy. Ah, <laughs> uh, man. You know, I, I have actually just been too busy to do live streams. I mean, just to put it into context, I go to the gym at like 10 p.m. or 9 p.m. I go to sleep at 12 or 1 my life is just, it's too good for Byron to ruin it, you know? <laughs> I got too many, I, I got too much money I need to be making, man. I got too many things to do. So, uh, yes, you know, when you're, when you, uh, when you work for, for yourself, it's, uh, it's a different, different experience, man. But yes, I, I apologize. I mean, bro, the last live stream was probably about the, the thing is, like, I wanted to do a watch along for the game. Uh, on Wednesday, but dude, I, I I forgot the game was going on after halftime. Like I I legitimately watched the first half, and then halftime came, and I had something else to go do, man. <laughs> I'm, I'm man. I then then it was like for 75 minutes. I was like, oh, the Bayern's playing, bro. I forgot. I forgot about the team, man, because I'm busy. I got I got things to do, man. But look, we'll try to do more live streams. We, we got. This big news with Satya Bowie, man. This club is depressing. I mean, wh who is this guy, man? Such a boy. Who's that? I mean, really? Now, I don't know anything about him, but I'm, I'm sure if he's good, uh, then all right. I mean, he's a right back from Galatasaray, from Turkey. And so he's good for Thanksgiving. See what I did there? Yeah. I think Bayern have failed this window. I expect Tuchel to be sacked probably in March. I mean, we're going to lose. I, I can sense us losing to a Lazio, one of those embarrassing ones. It's it's actually kind of depressing at yeah, Bayern right now. If not March, then perhaps April. Yeah, I don't know. It's 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 super sad. By the way, did you guys hear Jurgen Klopp is leaving Liverpool? Dude, yo, we, we might we might slide in real quick, you know? Slide in right there. You might come to us. Who knows? You might actually end up back at Dortmund if, you know, uh, when Tursich gets sacked. I shouldn't say if, because I know that man's getting sacked up, man, like balls. He's getting sacked. I know for a damn fact he's gone. He is gone, girl. Like freaking uh, Ben Affleck, man. He's gone. Yes, so... Sacha Bowie, I, I'm going to be honest. I don't know anything about him. Um, he's good. You guys are saying he's good. Here's the thing. I, I saved this for you guys. I'm going to go. Let's watch these highlights together. Let's analyze this game. We're going we to be watching. Man, let's watch how he balls out. Because I, I have a very clear idea of what I appreciate in footballers. He's a right back. He's 5'9". He's actually really perfect height for a right back. I wonder if he's fast. Is he fast? So, okay, it says his technical characteristics, you have dribbling 7 out of 10, technique 8 out of 10. So he looks like he's a technical guy. All right, cool, got it. That's that's what I, I wanted to hear. So that means he has a good first touch, like he can keep the ball in attack and defense. It looks like he's complete as well based on, oh, my gosh, bro, what is this ISIS hostage camera quality? What is going on here, man? I can't see. Yeah, I can't see nothing, bro. I can't see nothing. I can't see nothing. All right, look. Oh, wait, that, that was unnecessary, bro. Like, what was my man doing? Flicks. Bro, it was a two-yard pass, dog. Chill. All right, but 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 I like I like I like that. I like I like what he just did. Okay, okay. Look at the I like that too, man. I like that. All right. He's fast. He bomb bombs forward. And that that's not a highlight, bro. Who made this real, dog? This ain't no Instagram reel, dude. This is Facebook reels. 
bro, what the hell? He just touched the ball forward, and that's the highlight? Bruh, that ain't no highlight. See, this is a highlight, bruh. Look at the – oh, okay. I like what I'm seeing with the with the, with the the foots, with the feets, the foots and feets. I like that. It looked like he got footwork, that Floyd Mayweather footwork, man, evading challenges. That's what I like to see. Okay, simple pass around the corner. Pass over the top. Why doesn't this guy play for France? I mean, or, you know, the French national team. He's French. But, you know, he, he's one of them French where his dad came over from Zimbabwe and just did business with some French woman. Uh, wait, wait. He might be full on French because I don't see, like, a second citizenship. That's good. Yo, W's in chat, man. He, he's full on French. That So they signed him in 2021 for a million from uh, Stadi Renez, Rene. And yo, he's cooking right now, man. I'm seeing Gordon Ramsay on my on my eyeballs, my gigantic eyeballs. Look, yo, the crossing is good, man. He must be Christian. Ah, okay. Look at that. Look, look at that. It looks like he got link up plate. That's what I like to see, man. And he follows through. Look at that. Okay. Look, I, I like I like what I'm seeing in terms of attack. You know, defense is something we need to. Okay, the stepovers. You, he, he has, he has sold me. I just need to see stepovers, and I'm done. That's that's how I judge bowlers. If you ain't got stepovers, step out my line because I don't like you. Ooh, look at that. Okay, yeah, he is, he is quick, bro. He has that just short burst of complete yeah, exposure, explosiveness. Yeah, that's what I liked it. Okay, against Leroy Sane, but you know, Sane's on the left. He might as well just be useless. Sonny on the right, he's something, you know, we could cook. Him on the left, I, I don't know. I, I don't know about that. You don't have that in my uh yo, Leroy, man. You you need to you need to get back to your old self. We can't have that second half of the season curse. I don't want to see that. I want to see some bowling in the next few months. Long ball over the top. I see you, dude. I see you. Is this Man City? Oh, they got they get they get that got that CD CD blue, bro. CD blue. All right. Yeah, yeah, no, no. I think he has a lot of strength. I mean, again against Bayern. Bro, you know when you watch your team play against a certain team, you just get annoyed by what your players do, but you don't realize you're playing good players. So when I see him do these things against Bayern now, I'm like, "Oh, that's good." But when I was watching, I was like, "Damn, that's bad from Bayern." It's like perspective, you know? perspective wow i gotta say he looks very engaged in what's going on you know he looks like if you send him a ball yeah he looks like yeah defending like he's there attacking he's there he will be there we, we will be there like pep guardiola man we will be there we will be there we will be there yeah bro i like it again he's in midfield so versatility he can you know, pop into the midfield because he's intelligent enough to do it. Reading of the game, understanding the scenarios. Yo, he he actually looks kind of cold, man. I know it's Galatasaray, but nah. Yeah, I, I, I'm I taking him, bro. How much did we pay for him? 20, 25? Yeah, nah, I'll take, I'll take him, bro. Uh, like, no homo. That, I'll take him. So uh, his strengths are just everything, you know? I don't think... I think that this guy is 23 and he's just perfect. This is exactly what Byron needs. And I am very, very happy with this. So, it, oh, it's 30 million plus add ons. Yeah, he's 23. Here's the beautiful thing about a 23 year old and signing one if he fails, declines, you just give him up. You just sell him to some other club for 20, 20 million. You never lose. The good news is, you know, he's coming in knowing Maserawi is our number one. And, you know, unless this Tukela band guy just decides to screw us over and has this guy sitting on the bench, that would annoy me. 30 million with add-ons included. Okay, yeah, that's, that's a good deal because you have resale value for the long term. It's actually, it's, it's really good news, man. He will do great, someone said. Bruh, that is some loud noise, man. You guys hear all that? 
That is crazy. Twenty nine million uh, includes uh, bonus. So oh, wait, no, that's thank you Newcastle for rejecting, me, bro. Like I'm so glad I was not here to get high blood pressure from that entire era with us trying to get Kerry and Trip here, bro. That would have killed me. Like, like my life is going great. I got great things going on for me, man. You know. Like every second, I got great things going on. So, why why the hell would I want to be seeing Trippier, dog? Like, come on, dude. I don't want to see no Kiri and Trippier. But yeah, I'm good. Bowie, man, such a boy, man. Come over here to Bayern. Come to the Allianz Arena, the theater of complete chaos. Every transfer window, this club. You know, before the transfer, we we will do something in the transfer window. We will move. Nah, you, you ain't moving. You turned into Gary the Snail from SpongeBob. You are slow, mother zuckers. We got work to do. We got work to do, man. The Turkish Liga is below the Scottish Prem. I, I don't think you're you need dude. Galatasaray play in the Champions League and our scouts understand what these players are about and the, the ability they have. I am so happy to see Sacha Bowie come to Bayern because this is actually a player I rate. Yeah, I, I by the way, guys, what's going on, man? Jürgen Klopp, Hino, what happened to him? Klopp, Jürgen Klopp. You'll never walk alone. You'll never walk. You'll never walk alone. One from Liverpool. Jagen Klopp. Oh, man, I'm, I'm, I am miss doing these Scouse accents. Accents. So, eight hours in, still in shock, Liverpool fans say. Man, this is... So, did, he didn't get sacked or nothing, right? He just... Wow, bro. No club, no country for the next year. No other English club ever. Even if I have nothing to eat, it will not have... Yo, my man, Jurgen. Nah, that guy's been at Liverpool for like 10 years, so he deserves to just chill out elsewhere, man. Yo, this is Liverpool's banter era. They better not touch Hansi Flick. When when Tuchel gets that Sakinho, we need to get that Flickinho back. That's what I'm saying, man. That's, that's what I'm saying. Man saw De Bruyne come back and wants to retire. That's not that's not why. De Bruyne ain't he ain't scaring people like that. Like he I mean, KDB is just – oh, by the way, uh, Byron are going to get Max Herbal, and sources say he's not he's not really moved by Tuchel, so that's good. I'm going to be honest, man. I'm not even on the whole Tuchel out right now. I'm on the whole Tuchel will be out soon train. That's where I'm at. Oh, my gosh. Neo Aseko Nikili, bro. He has sustained an ankle injury. Bro, this is a long name, dude. A man got dots on top of his name, dude. It, it's it's one of yeah. He got two dots. Seiko got dots, and I'm sure Inkili got dots, man. We thought we were signing in Kunku, man. We, we signed in Inkili, dog. Damn. Yeah, this is the kid we got from Herder Berlin a few years ago, and we were all like, ah, he could be like the next Kante. It's kind of funny that we're all kind of racist because I mean, we didn't say he could be like the next Schweinsteiger because. He's black. <laughs> he black. So, so it's like a little different, you know. But yeah, I'm 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 actually really excited for this transfer. I wish this club could get serious about you know a defensive midfielder, and they didn't only get serious due to Conrad Limer's injury. Wait, Limer is injured, right? This is what I mean, boys. I I I gotta go soon. Like that's how busy I'm, I am. So, Kimmich, Limer, Upamecano out injured ahead of... Uh, yeah, okay, yeah. Kimmich is injured too. Oh, my gosh, man. Everybody injured. Everybody injured. So, yo, Morocco need to be knocked out of AFCON for the sake of Bayern, dude. Are they even in AFCON? Wait, have I been under the impression that Masrawi was out because he was at the AFCON? No, this Negro is just injured. No, no, he's still at AFCON. That's what I'm saying. Yeah, yeah. Wait, no, no, dude. Congo versus Morocco. Okay, but like, it's match day three. 
Yeah, Morocco versus Zambia. They won. Ah, so they're in the round of 16s against South Africa. Ah, damn, bro. They're going to win that competition. I ain't trying to see that. Who? I, uh, I don't I don't care about AFCON. I, uh, whichever country has the most, the best roads should win. So none of them. Bro, like <sighs> Nigeria. Ah, you know, I, I'm going to root for Cameroon, of course. Um Mali, Burkina Faso. I, 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 I'm a, I'm gonna go with Burkina Faso, man. Morocco, South Africa. I'm gonna go with South Africa, man. Yeah, there's more black people. <laughs> no, I'm joking. No, I gotta go with Maz. No, I, I need I need Morocco to lose, bro. We need, I need Maserawi back in this team. We're getting cooked without him. And people people underestimate how good Maserawi is, man. Yeah, we we need him back. He's like a, a big guy for them, huh? Plays every game. Wait, I'm tripping. Maserati's just injured. Oh, my gosh. Nah, ain't no way I'm tripping like this, bro. Dude, he's he's just injured. Bro, this whole... See, that I'm not watching AFCON, bro. He's injured. <laughs> bro, I'm actually... I'm actually a, a retard, bro. Like, that's crazy. <laughs> Bro, he's just injured. He has a torn muscle bundle. Dog, we move from fibers to just bundles. My man is tearing muscles. Like, uh, tear one, tear another one for free or something. What do you mean bundle? Damn, man. Like, he just got two injuries in one? Ain't no way, bro. Yo, I I thought he was an AFCON. <laughs> this man's, he's just injured. Nah, that's crazy. Uh, he he can injure himself on a blade of grass. Nah, he's not injury prone. Not that injury prone. Prefer someone else other than. Look, I, at this point, I'll take I'll take Paulina's sister, bro. <laughs> like we we just I, I I want anyone, bro. Sacha Bowie is from La Republique du Cameroon. All right, got it. Um. Poor Klopp, he coached Gravenberg for a few months and then had enough. Man, you guys are tripping. Real Madrid 2.0. I thought Chupo was from Cameroon. Uh, yeah, Chupo didn't get called up, man. Samuel Eto said, nah, you ain't coming in. Chupo was like, yo, what's up? What happened to my password? I can't, I can't log in. And Eto said, nah, I changed the password, dude. You I changed Orego Bet song. He said, nah, you ain't singing my song today. And Chupo didn't show up. Man, yeah, nah, Chupo is not playing. That's kind of sad for Chupo because he was cooking with them. With La Republique du Camagoon. Yo, I see a, a guy on Cameroon's team that Bayern might be interested in. Junior Chemedu, dog. Yo, this club might sign that guy. They might sign Junior Chamedu just because it sounds like Chuameni. <laughs> uh, you know, I think we should do like a universal, um, like rules for language and names, bro. You cannot if 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 your name has a T in it and the T is silent, we should just take it out. Because, bro, I feel like people would know how to say these names better if there wasn't like a confusing, like go. Gamelu, bro. Like, if your name needs me to say like half of a sound, like N, right? And I have to say, D. bro, Gamelu. Nah, just say Gamelu, Gamelu. Just say that. Don't add like an N before that. That that's what I, bro. Nah, people are crazy, man. Yeah, nah, they're crazy. Like, bro, racism could end tomorrow if, like, bro, if your name is Simon Kapaduchbu, bruh, like, that's why you, you get racially abused, dog. Your name is Kapandutbu. Nah, that's, that's nuts, bruh. That's crazy. That's, that's outrageous. Yeah, see, that's what I'm saying. People don't want to hear me. But I, I'm literally giving this guy tips and tricks. Like, bro, you're going to get racially abused if people can't even say your name. 
then they're like, oh, but what about the Eastern European? Nah, I can say Abramovich better, easier than Ngopende Putbu, bro. Oh, my gosh. That name got my tongue. Just crazy. Yeah, but he's 28. Nah, I'll take anything. Zub Mendy, nah, he ain't coming in. Can you make a prediction for our playing 11 next year? We are next year, my man. You mean next season? Uh, or you mean like 2020? Oh, yeah, yeah. Let me just give you starting 11 in 2025 when half our team don't play here because this club's incompetent and not ambitious enough to keep these players here. Yeah, I, I don't know. I, I think we're probably going to end up losing Davies because why would he stay here? People are like crazy. Alfonso Davies is looking at it like, yo, I'll go to Madrid and win Champions Leagues every season, but I'll stay at Bayern and lose to Lazio. I feel like we'll lose that game, man. I don't I don't have any any trust in this team. This team used to gas me up every every summer, man. We sign a few few bums. We all get gassed like, oh, we could it's our year. It's never our year, man. Davies is overrated. See, people only say that cuz he's le- he wants to leave or he's thinking of leaving. I think Davies is happy at Bayern, but Bayern need to just uh pay him that money. Honestly, he'd, he'd stay. See, that's the thing. Why would Davies be motivated? We we have not done enough to put ourselves in a position to do everything. Look, I, I think losing this league is, is going to do, do us a lot of damage. But short term, but long term, it ain't that bad of a, of a thing to have happen, you know, because it, it'll make this club do some things. This club is actually going to feel their ego cooked a little bit. You know, I feel like every guy needs to be utterly embarrassed in his life for him to finally take things a little seriously. That's what that's what needs to happen to Bayern. We need to be embarrassed. We need never Kuzin to be sometimes Kuzin. Like if they if they pull it off, if Xabi Alonso pulls it off, you know, the board's just going to be like, yo, we got it. OK, we got to get back. And they might actually take running this Bayern institution seriously because they aren't doing it at the moment. They are not doing it at the moment. Ah, right. Well, I appreciate you all watching this on Bayern now. Hit the like button if you haven't. That would be greatly appreciated. But yeah, I mean, this story is crazy. This Yo, I like this guy. He got drip. He got drip. Such a boy. Nah, such a boy, bruh. That's what I like to see. Nah, I want I want to see him come to Bayern and do his thing. His thing. So, is he ever getting called up for France or nah? Nah, I want to I want to see if he gets called up for France. For les Français. Yo, what the flip? This guy gets like 300k uh, uh, Instagram posts. Yo, them them Turkish fans are, they are ridiculous, bro. Ridiculous, ridiculous. All right, thank you everyone so much for watching. Mia sent me an end piece. Someone said Bayern Bayern want to buy Killian. That's that's where you got it wrong because we would not be buying Killian. We would be signing him for free. Except we'd be paying like a hundred million to his agent for the sign-on bonus. Goodbye.